Welcome to this week's Weekly Roundup, where we bring you all the top stories from this week. I'm Kirsten Mitchell with GTV. A University of Minnesota journalism instructor has landed a new position. Keith Moyer accepted a job as Editor-in-Chief and Senior Vice President of the Las Vegas Review-Journal. Black Lives Matter St. Paul threatened to protest and shut down Red Bull's crashed ice ice skating competition set later this month. Governor Dayton said in a press conference Tuesday that he respects their right to protest. Red Bull Crash Ice said that the event will continue as planned. The results from the New Hampshire primary indicated that Republican Donald Trump won with 35% of the votes, and on the Democratic side, Bernie Sanders at 60%. Scientists announced the discovery of gravitational waves on Thursday, proving Einstein's prediction over a century ago. Bernie Sanders visited Minneapolis on Friday night and spoke to a large crowd in Northeast Minneapolis. Some Latin American countries are considering lifting abortion bans following the outbreak of the Zika virus. Thanks for watching. Tune in every Sunday for a new roundup.